Hi, this is your teacher, <clears throat> Barbara Rademacher, and a student just sent, sent me this question. Write an equation of the line containing the given point and parallel to the given line. Well, what does that mean? Well, here's the given point. 3, negative 6. The line goes through that point, and it's parallel to the given line. Here's the given line. Okay, here's the trick. The slope, since we're looking for parallel, The slope that we use to find the equation of this line will be the same as this slope. So, the slope right here. So let's find the slope of this line. Subtract 6x from both sides. That'll leave us negative 5y equals negative 6x plus 4, and then divide through by negative 5, negative 5, negative 5, and what we'll get is y equals positive 6 fifths x minus 4 fifths. Now, this is what we need from there, which is the slope of this line. Now we're going to use that slope with this point. All right, so let's see. y minus y1 equals m times x minus x1. So y minus negative 6 will give us y plus 6 equals 6 fifths times x minus 3. So y plus 6 equals 6 fifths x minus 6 over 5 times 3, which you can always put in your calculator. And what you ought to get is y plus 6 equals 6 fifths x minus 18 fifths. Now we're going to subtract 6 from both sides. So we'll have y equals 6 fifths x minus 18 fifths minus 6. But since I'm not using a calculator, I'm going to transform the number 6, well here negative 6, into a number that has 5 in the denominator. And I happen to know that if I were to divide 30 by 5, I would get 6. And so, yeah, what I'm going to have then is y equals 6 fifths x minus 48 fifths. And that should be the equation of the line through this point and parallel to this line. Check it out and see if that's correct.